One of my earliest childhood memories is in my dad's Model 82 BMW. Growing up in Egypt, I can never forget how much fun we had on those long road trips to the coast. But that's not the story I want to share with you today. My story is about a series of challenges that started very early on in life. As a kid, I was diagnosed with severe chest asthma. I used to wake up every night unable to breathe properly. Despite popular advice, I decided to take part in a race, an 800 meter race. And I finished seventh out of eight, which was very hard for me to take. So I decided to train very hard and I'd wake up every morning at 5 a.m. before school and try to really push myself beyond the limits of where I thought I could go. One year later, I managed to gather enough courage to run that same race again and finished first. A few years later, I discovered the mountains and my life was never the same again. It was actually the first time I'd ever seen snow. 12 years later, on the 17th of May of 2007, I stood on the top of Mount Everest and became the first Egyptian and youngest Arab to do so. I see things differently now. It's no longer just about the mountain or being first. I know now that I have a responsibility to tell the story, to inspire people, especially youth. And in order to do that, I need to continue to share the story and I need to continue to push my own limits. This is why, after Everest, I climbed the highest mountain on every continent, the Seven Summits, and is why next year I plan to go to outer space. My next challenge is arguably the most personal of all. A journey on board my BMW to tour Egypt from north to south, to visit a hundred schools and universities, to tell my story, to inspire kids. I want to tell them that the limits that exist only exist in their own minds. It brings me goosebumps to complete this journey in a BMW much like my father's. It really feels like I've come full circle. My name is Omar Samra and this is my BMW story.